What does NPK stand for? It stands for nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. On every bottle of fertilizer that you see, there's going to be an NPK listed on the front of it. That refers to the percentage by volume of those given elements in the bottle. So this is 4% nitrogen, 3% phosphorus, and 3% potassium. The reason this product has lower numbers is because it's a liquid. So the water creates a certain amount of the volume, lowering the NPK. If we look at a powder product, like Backcountry Blend by Green Planet Nutrients, soon to be released in your area, we see a 1688. The reason these numbers are higher is because it's a dry product. There's no water in it. So we're able to achieve a higher percentage by volume of nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. So these are all major nutrients, macronutrients, that are required in large amounts by the plant. They are termed mobile because the plant can move them around throughout its structure depending on where it needs them. So obviously the plant will transfer needed potassium or nitrogen or phosphorus to the new growth. So if we are seeing a genuine nutrient deficiency related to NPK, it will generally show in the lower growth because the plant is going to take those nutrients away from the less important lower growth, providing them for the very important new growth. So that is an expl explanation of NPK, your uh, macronutrients, mobile nutrients. Thanks for tuning in.